I wasn't about to cut you any breaks back then. But I swallowed every lie Levi told me, and he played me for a fool. You were nobody's fool. Nobody's. Okay. Ten more minutes, but then we get out. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, Chief. Nathan, I need you to execute a warrant at Windermere. Nicholas, this box, it could decide who's going to become yes, our next mayor. Do you realize how bad this looks? You practically financed Felicia's entire campaign. I can, I can explain if you would just... I'm afraid you're going to have to do your explaining downtown. I'm sorry, Nicholas, you got to come with us. Is this really necessary? No, we don't have a choice. There's a warrant. Well, there's got to be some kind of misunderstanding. There's no, there's no misunderstanding. Wait, no, 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 don't do, say anything. Do what you have to do, Dante. Nicholas Cassidy, you're under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. Stop! Cuff me! I'm the culprit. I'm the one who took the ballot box. What's going on? Nathan said he had to arrest Nicholas for uh, election tampering? Maxie, I swear, I had nothing to do with this. Well, I know you would never, and neither would Nicholas, so there has to be another explanation. Let me in chains. Drag me away. Nobody's dragging you anywhere. But I'm guilty. Spencer, look, I know you get in trouble sometimes, and you've been grounded. A lot. But you wouldn't steal a ballot box. Yes, I would. Father, tell them I sworn to tell the truth. Alfred found the box in Spencer's toy chest last night. I've been up half the night trying to figure out whose attention I should bring this to. Then we showed up. Wait, Spencer, why did you have these votes? I know you weren't trying to rig an election. I didn't know what they were. Okay, well, then how did you get the box? It was New Year's Eve. Father was out celebrating. I wanted to see the fireworks when the grand might... My babysitter wouldn't let me. So I snuck out. Your great-grandmother insisted you be in bed before midnight. Great-grandmother insists on a lot of things. But she left without telling my father and she put you in charge. And you were for me. So, let's go. Then that's when I saw it. Saw what? A man and a woman dropping this box into the water. I'm going to get this to uh, City Hall. Hey, behave yourself. Am I going to prison, Uncle Dante? 